G4 is coming back. Welcome back to G4 TV. Welcome back. You want to hear about video games, computer and tech and gadget talk? It was on G4. But I actually want to talk about something so much more important than Red Dead Online. Sexism in gaming. G4 TV, which recently just came back from the dead, went on a mega rant and took a page from Druckmann claiming viewers are sexist pigs and racists. Pretty bad if they ruined it though. Hopefully they didn't ruin it for themselves, right? Huh. Number 10. The shows are too long! <laughs> Is it? Me? I'm very traumatized by this moment. Okay, good. Because <laughs> the, the, the distillation of facts from Waiting in the Wings, because I really didn't know what I was walking into when they yeah. handed me this today. All right, let's I'll, try and... I'll, you know what? This is, I'll give you... We'll give Halo each other a pass. Halo 1 at 3 if you give me Halo 3 at 1. X-Play is nearly two hours long! Attack of the Show is nearly three hours long! The shows are too long! Number nine. The TV schedules suck! Attack of the show is nearly on every day! There's hardly new content! X-Play is nearly on every day! Everything is repeats! Number 8. Scott DeWaz Strange Edits! Yeah, I passed and pre-ordered on Amazon. Uh, guess when I got it? After the shipping delay? Right now. I did finally fulfill 2014 Scott's wishes and found a new copy of the Smash Wii U Collector's Box. Yeah, I passed and pre-ordered on Amazon. Uh, guess when I got it? After the shipping delay? Right now. I did finally fulfill 2014 Scott's wishes and found a new copy of the Smash Wii U Collector's Box. Of course, being battery powered meant more times than not when I'd want to play one of these things, I'd pull it out of storage and go, oh fing shit, I left this thing on for a month. Of course, being battery powered meant more times than not when I'd want to play one of these things, I'd pull it out of storage and go, oh fing shit, I left this thing on for a month. Of course, when talking about games that are lost and can't be played anymore, everybody has to mention Club Penguin, an online game where you just bro out with other people all displayed as penguins. Of course, when talking about games that are lost and can't be played anymore, everybody has to mention Club Penguin, an online game where you just bro out with other people all displayed as penguins. Number 7. Adam Sess is hardly in the studio for his own show! Hello, 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 hello! Welcome back to another episode of X-Play Live. As always, I am Adam Tesler. Sessler, live from the San Francisco cesspool, and eventually the Black Okage. With Dex Mantha. Yeah, Dex Mantha. She bit me. I, myself, am in my cozy cesspool in the sourdough haven of San Francisco. Number six, bringing in the politics vibe. Number five, no Morgan Webb and no Olivia Mon. The next day, a former vice president is telling you there will never be snow on Mount Kilimanjaro again because you drove to a supermarket a block and a half from your house and however carbon neutral your lifestyle is, the mercurial ways of weather are never going to change. Snowstorms, sandstorms, and on really bitchin' occasions, motor storms, as in our next game. Oh, strawberry. I can't wait to plow your fields. Oh, James, you had me a plow. <laughs> oh, James, oh, look at that. Oh, you're, you're so hot. You, James, ever. Thanks. Thank you. Oh, great thing. Oh, by the way, I'm not British. No, you're not. <laughs> no, American. Number four. 
ignoring the gamers. Number 3 Better gaming content on YouTube and Twitch The Nintendo Wii Mini would be an interesting footnote in Nintendo history. It first appeared exclusively in Canada in December of 2012. Hey guys, Metal Jesus here. Now today I want to share with you my entire Dreamcast game collection. Especially because we did Absolute Zero on Cornell, not Violetta. Uh, so hopefully she's in the same row as him. So this will hit both of them. Hey guys, so I've been putting this off long enough and I finally started playing Castlevania 64. You are given a Pokedex to attempt to fill up by Professor Rowan, as well as a starter Pokemon with Turtwig, Piplup and Chimchar being the grass, water and fire types offered to you in order to then have a chance of defeating the Elite Four. This scene, for instance, sees a 2 to 5 FPS performance difference between the lowest settings and the highest settings. Number 2. The game reviews are too old! I finally found a home in one of FromSoft's best games, Dark Souls 3. Dark Souls 3 is the final installment in the Dark Souls trilogy. Now that ham-fisted segue is out of the way, let's talk about Resident Evil 7. One of those games was 2018's God of War, a fresh new take on a franchise we loved back in the yesteryears of X-Play, and after a nice long break from the spotlight, a couple trips to an anger management seminar, and failing a Mori Povich paternity test, the franchise has returned in a big way. It can be hard to capture the magic of something you did so well in the past and improve upon it. I mean, not that I'm speaking from experience. Our review begins right here. With Borderlands 3, a whole new set of Vault Hunters, more weapons and violence, and most importantly, me. Number 1 ah! Sexism in gaming. In joining G4, I was ecstatic to be part of something that I grew up watching as a child. But every time G4 is brought up in various channels, even in this YouTube channel, we have the chat in front of us, I can see you, without a doubt, there will be backlash because I'm not as bangable as the previous host. It's somehow- Talk to him, Frost! It has somehow been expected that you can talk about how much you jerked off to women as a compliment. That's it's weird. not a compliment. It's weird. It's dehumanizing and it's weird. Women do not exist to be nice on the eyes for you. Morgan Webb, Olivia Munn did not exist to be nice on the eyes for you. And that's just <laughs> obvious sexism. You don't need to explicitly objectify women or declare that you hate women to be sexist. Adam will read a script written by the same writer that I will read the other half of the script for, but I'll be the one flamed. And yeah, it also happens to Gerard and TBH, but that doesn't discount the sexism of how it happens to me when it does. Both things can be true, that there is a general hatred of any change that isn't Adam, and that all receive special flame just for being a woman. When you're in our DMs or on those YouTube comments or in Twitch chat right now, those reactionary threads thinking that I'm somehow ruining your current X-Play experience because you can't objectify me how you previously did to Morgan, or that I'm somehow less qualified to speak on something, but you can't quite put your finger on why, even though I'm reading the exact same script as Adam, but you have no problem with he's part of it, you're letting your unconscious biases ruin my day and you're gatekeeping the gaming space. So maybe for 2022, we'd be a bit nicer, a bit more self-reflective, and we enjoy the fact that people are working hard to make free content for you. If you don't like it, don't watch it. Peace! Oh well, never mind. That's it! That's your lot! 
Didn't you see anything that was mentioned on the list? Comment below and let me know! They should really bring back G4TV.com. That show was alright! If you're not subscribed, subscribe! Do it now! Bye!